Thank you so much for joining us for our Pet of the Week segment this week. I'm joined by Bella Carcamo from Carcamo, excuse me, from yeah. Beauty Humane Society, and you've brought in a super handsome and sweet yes. boy. Yes, this is Bishop. He's a six-year-old Labradoodle. He's so sweet, well-mannered, trained, um, good on leash, and all around just a good boy. Yeah, he certainly is, and he's been making the rounds behind the scenes, as yeah. they all do, on the way in, and everyone's been given him a little bit of love and he's been really enjoying that. Yeah. Now, Bishop is very sweet. You mentioned he's well trained. Yes. There is one thing that people need to know about him and that's... Yes, yeah, so he recently came to us as an owner surrender um, because he has separation anxiety. So he doesn't like to be away from his person. Um, so he'd be great if you work from home or you like to companion animal to take with you. He's good with cats, he's good with dogs. Um, for children, we would recommend 10 and up just because we don't want to give him, you know, more anxiety or stress. But he's super, just a good guy. Um, he's on medication currently, so that's been helping. Um, but since he's been in our shelter, he's adjusted beautifully. Um, he's been just a, just a delight for all of our volunteers to go and walk him. Yeah, and it's, he was fairly recently surrendered as well. So he's new yes. to the Humane Society. If you've been out there... Yeah maybe a week or more yeah, he, ago, you wouldn't have found him. No, he's very recent, and um, because he has separation anxiety, we knew he needed to go into a foster home, so he's going into a foster home today, um, which is gonna be fantastic because dogs with anxiety don't do well in a shelter environment. Um, they do much better in a home environment where they can get that kind of one-on-one -on -one attention and care. So we're so thankful that we have a foster home that's gonna take him, and so he can adjust and be with a person. Yeah, and he is, what, what do you think the ideal fit for him would be? So um, ideal fit, someone who, one, wants a companion animal and can devote a lot of time to him. Just because he does have separation anxiety, um, if you work from home, if you're really active and you like to take your dog everywhere with you, he loves people. He loves people. He loves other animals. He likes people. Um, I mean, other, you know, he just likes to be out and about. Um, someone who has the same energy level, so someone ca that can play with him, be active, hike, um, and if you do have kids, like I said, like 10 and up would be ideal just because he, you know, you don't want to make him more nervous. The younger you get, it can be yeah. a little bit difficult with some rough play. So, yeah, for sure. And you were mentioning he's the kind of dog that would like to go places with you. Yeah. And he's the type of dog that's going to be able to go places with you because he's so yeah. well behaved. Yeah. So his previous owners did a lot of training with him. So he's very well trained. He's great on leash, um, has amazing manners. He's potty trained. I mean... Very rarely do we get a dog that checks off all these boxes in our shelter, so we believe he's going to go, you know, to a, to a good home, you know. Oh, I think so. I think there's going to be quite a bit of interest. I think so, too. And, like, he's just so beautiful, so sweet. And also, like you were saying, he's very deceptive. He's so soft. Yeah, he looks like... He looks like he wouldn't be, but he's so soft. He's so beautiful. He really is, yeah. When I gave him his first pet, I was kind of taken back, like... You don't look like you're this soft, but you are. Yeah, he's and giving it, you a full little body, so you can see. Yeah, he is. Yeah, do a little fashion show. Bishop is such a sweetheart. Well, he is six years old. He's six years old. He's a neutered male. He's a labradoodle. And, of course, Bishop here was a home surrender. So yeah. this guy came from a loving home, Yeah. and he is looking for a great forever loving home, and I think he certainly deserves it. Yeah. Uh, and... He's going to have a fantastic time. Yeah, he's so such that. a sweet boy, and, you know, he's a, he's definitely a favorite at our shelter right now for all our volunteers, and he's only been there a little bit of time, so. <laughs> well, I can't blame them. He's so sweet. Yeah, very well-mannered. Um, if you're interested in him, you can fill out an application on our website, buttehumane.org forward slash adopt-a-dog. Um, but, yeah, check out photos of him on our social media, Butte Humane Society. Um, he's just he's just a good boy. Yeah, and set up an appointment boy. to come meet this guy. I yeah. think that uh, I think if you do, you're probably... You're probably going to want them. Yeah. Thank you so much for bringing them in. Thank you for having us.